Hello Sagittarius! This is your August 2019 bonus reading as I had promised you. It's a five card spread. It's a basic spread. And I'm asking for new energies that's coming in for the end of August 2019. Hopefully positive energies for um, Sagittarius. For those born in the zodiac sign of Sagittarius. New energies. I may come up with the you know, same story or continuing from the last reading, or I may come up with a new energy, but this is um, not going to resonate with all Sagittarius individuals, but I'm hoping to reach the majority of you. And I always look for a positive reading, but if we don't get one, as you know, we work through it. Queen of Rods, this is you in the upright and as you know i do not so i do not assign a one zodiac sign to a court card because we read for the masses but this is the queen of rods aries leo sagittarius in the upright finally taking control got their crown on feel like they want to take their crown on in the past you were battling with somebody a little bit of strife maybe some competition with the five of wands what is coming towards you, or the natural what's coming towards you, what's your obstacle, is the Queen of Swords in reverse. And that will be an obstacle. That could be Air, um, Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Yeah, that is an obstacle, all right. Current environment. You feel like your ships aren't coming in. You feel like everything is against you in some way with the Three of Wands in reverse, which isn't true. It's not true. It's a grabbing again. And I'm going to clarify these. And as you know, when I clarify, I can change the story. What is coming towards you? The Seven of Wands. Someone may want you to stand up for yourself. Someone may get on top of things. Someone may take control with the Seven of Wands. I wanted to clarify that one for sure. Oh, I've got to fix that stupid camera. In the end, you're dealing with a message, a uh, straight to the point message, one that comes pretty quickly and um, is pretty honest. It's for some of you, again, you can be dealing with Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. They are in the upright. My pages I see as messengers or um, a younger type um, air sign. We'll see, but we gotta find out what's going on because it's kind of interesting for some of you. What we're dealing with here is maybe there was some strife, a battle of some sort. Maybe you got in an argument with somebody. Usually with the Five of Wands, it doesn't go beyond an argument. It doesn't get, you know, physical if This is with the Five of Wands usually. That's usually the Five of Swords. So the Five of Wands in the upright, in the past position while you're there for Sagittarius for August. King of Pentacles, you could have been battling or having a strike with the King of Pentacles in reverse. This is also um, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. But it also could be someone who uh, lacks stability and they feel like they lack stability or security in life. And maybe that's why the battle occurred or the argument or strife. So Five of Wands in the upright, King of Pentacles in reverse while you're there for Sagittarius in the past. And you feel a little trapped by a situation that you feel like you can't get out of with the Eight of Swords. But that's all mental energy. It doesn't have to be. Let me move this over just a wee bit. See if I can get a better picture. There we go. Now, the obstacle is the Queen of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. They are in reverse, and hell have no fury like the Queen of Swords in reverse. So, if you're dealing with this type of person, I can understand why there was a battle or arguments or a situation that you are having trouble with. So, the Queen of Swords in reverse while you're there for Sagittarius as the obstacle in August. Yeah, you may not accept it, something they offered you, or and maybe they got angry. Or they, did, you, they didn't accept something you offered with the Four of Cups in reverse. So the Queen of Swords, Four of Cups, as the obstacle, both in reverse while you're there for Sagittarius. The Chariot, and something came to a dead halt with the Chariot, or it became very chaotic. 
Now, as the current environment, as we're speaking, you feel like your ships aren't coming in. You're feeling like everything is just bust. You know, it doesn't work out. So the Three of Wands in reverse as the current environment in August. Why are you there for Sagittarius? Yeah, you feel you're... You're, you're, you're thinking like, because that's the Seven of Pentacles. It, you are coming out of failure, but you feel like you're not going to. Because you got the Seven of Pentacles in reverse, and it could be that you refuse to even think about it anymore. You're, get, you're giving up. You're, you're giving up, you know? But don't, because I saw September's reading. If you haven't, go ahead and watch it. I'm coughing a lot in there, but it's the first energy that came in for September, so I had to use it. And I know the Ten of Pentacles was in there that promised you really good things. So that's in September's reading. But now you got the as uh, the current environment right now, you're feeling like your ships aren't coming in. You got the Seven of Pentacles. You got the Three of Wands in reverse. You're going blah blah blah. I don't believe this. So the Three of Wands, Seven of Pentacles. Why you there is the current environment for Sagittarius. What's going on? Nine of Wands. Yeah, that's you, possibly, you know, uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, in reverse. You feel like you're just going to put a complete to halt everything. You're going to give up. I hope not. Actually, I'm pretty sure you're not, but you're just feeling down and out. It's, it's nothing wrong with what's going on in the future. You're going to get better, but you're just feeling really blah. Outside environment, you got the Seven of Wands in the upright. It's about taking a stand, taking vow, you know, be, you know, doing what's right, getting on top of things. So seven of wands, why are you there for Sagittarius was coming towards them of the outside environment. I think someone may be giving you a little bit of a push. Yeah, justice in reverse. Someone may be taking a stand, whether you or somebody else, maybe someone's taken up for you um, because of injustice that was done. Some of you may be taking on this energy going against people from the outside. Yeah, there's a Five of Wands, trying to overcome strife. Something you're not going to be celebrating with the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So, for some of you, you could be taking on an energy where you're going to start standing up for yourself for an injustice and, you know, just a lot of drama that you had. Something that cost you. Or it could be, I'm thinking somebody else is going to take up for you also. Someone's going to take up for you a little bit. But you had some battles. I'm not kidding. I could see Sagittarius having some battles. But it gets better. It does get better. Just let it get better. you got to believe in it. So in the end, the Page of Swords is in the upright. I told you what that was about. You know, what it represented. Now let's see what's clarifying it. Page of Swords in the upright. Why are you there for Sagittarius? For August. The Hierophant, about broken contracts or not doing something like the status quo. <clears throat> I think if someone's going to try to shock you, not really shock you, but get you back on your feet again over things that didn't work out, that you feel that maybe some of you went through a divorce. Maybe you hear about divorce. Maybe someone sends you a message. Maybe court papers could be. Let me see, Page of Swords in the upright, the Hierophant in reverse, why are you there for Sagittarius in the final outcome? Yeah, Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Some of you will get a message about somebody saying about broken contracts. Sometimes it's about jobs, sometimes about relationships, sometimes it's about just what's going on around you in general in society. And you feel like it's a bad luck situation, but it does get better with se uh, September's reading. It does. But you feel like you're in a battlement right now over something that you have to take up for yourself for. And you still feel like your ships aren't coming in in August, the end of August. But they are in September. But you are still going through stuff um, in the early part of the reading in September. And it ends well, but you still got people coming after you. So um, you are trying to get in your head. So don't think that the Three of Wands will not come in, because it will. You're still thinking that way. You're still thinking that your ships have sailed. They're not coming for you. And this is the King of Wands, is you again. This is um, Aries Leo Sagittarius, and they got the crown on again. 
and they overcome heartbreak. You do get a lot of options, even though you don't like options. And even though maybe you felt like judgment was going against you in everything you do. Some of you, this has to do with a relationship, court proceedings, job. You feel like you're just fighting day after day after day, but it does get better. Like I said, I saw it in September's reading. Starts off kind of rough, but you get your Ten of Pentacles. You get your Nine of Pentacles in the upright, which you're fighting for over here. You get it in the upright. So things do look up for a lot of you, but you got to believe in it. And you got you can't get so down and out that you don't try. Because I see that also, someone just kind of giving up on everything, not trying. Don't give up. Don't get in your head and keep moving forward, okay? And this is your reading, and I will upload this as soon as I can. Um, probably, I don't know, later on today, maybe. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.